because I had took a break for uh, two years. So again, I restarted my career from actually I had lost hopes. But, but what happened? What made you lose hope? Maybe because of the COVID and probably the approach because of the new skills I felt which is which was lacking because a lot of competition outside the market. Veena is here. Hi, Veena. Long time. Hope you're doing good. Who's Hi, got results? How are you? I am good. How are you? You've completed a year. Congratulations. All will complete this year. Yeah. How are we going to celebrate this? <laughs> Seriously, from zero to something I have now. I am now. Uh, you're very humble. You had 17 years of experience, but you said from zero. In what context? Because I had took a break for uh, two years. So again, I restarted my career from... Uh, actually, I had lost hopes. But, but what happened? What made you lose hope? Maybe because of the COVID and probably the approach. Because of the new skills I felt, which is which was lacking. Because a lot of competition outside the market. So you I were think... an HR consultant earlier, but after COVID, yeah. you were like, what to do? Yeah, yes. All my... Through contacts only, I used to get my freelancing. But after mm -hmm. that, I had I exhausted all my contacts. Yeah, because that eight-month period... Yes. Or one year period suddenly was like, what the hell is happening? Nobody wants to pay consultants. Nobody wants to hire. People are finding whom to fire. And, mm -hmm. and that was a reckoning for so many people, right? Yes. But And that is when the people who truly discovered remote work, for them, it became like, this is an opportunity, right? Abhi, the kind of comfort you all have, some of you, you have jobs, right? You have clients. But that time, suddenly it all vanished. And then... People saw with astounding clarity that international remote work is what I can do. Tell us about this a little more. So you took a two years break and then you started from scratch, you're saying, in March yeah. last year. Yeah, in the March, I had attended the same boot camp with you. So, so your <laughs> Upwork account, you do you do on Upwork? Yeah, yeah, my Upwork account, actually, there my earnings are visible. So and you did uh, from zero, right? Yeah, zero. from 4,000 plus dollars I have earned so far. Wow. Outside of work, I took a lot more work because the same client uh, has given me. So they can anyway, always, yeah, it is visible like. Super. So this I not done in one year, guys. And yeah. this is an IGNU MBA, so normal MBA. And I, I got a rating also, you can see one Porsche, yeah. that was a Porsche work, one-time work. And yeah. this is only one-time work here. She gave me the right rating. And post that one client made, paid you uh, one okay, and other yeah, hundred and fifty dollars. And then post that we work di directly because thirteen percent mm -hmm. I have to pay up work. So it was a little bit expensive for me. I thought since I had, had developed a wrap up, so yeah, she came yeah. out and she gave me eight more cases of international posh mm -hmm. and much before I completed the international posh course. Where is this client from? New York. Oh, wow. And she gave you cases of sexual harassment work, which is international labor and sexual yes. compliance. Wow. Yeah, it was a very good work with her. She was very good, actually. Now I am like any anybody who approaches her, I am the go-to posh consultant for her. For which countries? Any New country? York. New York. New York, you are the <laughs> person. Can you all believe it, guys? Log India can ban paate hai, New York ka bol rahe that she has done. It's so happy, my luck, probably. Yeah, I no, so I'll tell you. I don't think it's luck. I, I don't think it's luck, Veena. I think it is hard work and your humility that has gotten you so far. Yeah, so, and we have a definition for luck because we are into teaching, right? So we have to study everything, no? So luck is when preparation meets opportunity. <laughs> so opportunity is there. We have shown you. But you have to be prepared to get it, right? Veena was prepared to get it. I so never said no to any project, actually. I used to grab all projects. Yeah. And she was prepared. She was training herself, right, to do international work. Can you tell us what was different? What did you learn here with us? How were we able to help you? And Mansi, feel free to take over the conversation. Oh, yeah. 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 <laughs> actually, March, I give, actually, it was at my birthday. It was a coincidentally when I attended. So I gifted myself this course. Uh, yeah. Of course, uh, I didn't have money. I swiped my credit card. I never knew, like I'm able to get uh, 100 times. Now I got back my uh, fees. I never expected that this will be the transformation. But till June, I suffered. I yeah. did not get. 
then in the month of june i got one client from singapore he had approached he wants to start his operations in bangalore so like that my work started and then he start, he initially paid me 5 and 1/2 dollars only per hour so recently he doubled me whereas i said i i was busy with posh work i said i am unable to continue he said no i can't lose you he, you want what you want so thinking that he won't pay me double i i said i want double so he said i will give you <laughs> so i don't want to lose you so that's what the conversation happened i want you i can't lose you so he gave me double and then yes i was okay i can i have to work for him now and then post that like i am working for one edtech company as a hr automation specialist and apart from that posh very in a very big company 1000 plus employees i am in getting engaged so i am conducting in the third week of february it's a very good it's a, a big project for me apart from that one more uh, two more projects for uh, 10000 employees it's a big company i am we are discussing we are still discussing it's in the proposal stage but uh, i feel posh is really green <laughs> <laughs> for me apart from that uh, i have not left any opportunity out of my hand recently one of my client from california he had approached me for the training for some eight people some career counseling something whereas and some other training he asked me hr training i said okay i have taken that also that trial session is on the thursday i have scheduled then you know veena i if it were to me i would not stop you and i would just not pause you and i am just loving listening to your journey yeah, and thank I'm you so just, much i am just so inspired by the work that you have done and this this never say die i didn't say no to anything that is just so rare with 17 years of experience sometimes people get oh i won't do this they get very picky and choosy about what they would do but that that you say you were a yes to life and you were a yes to opportunities that came your way is actually what got you where you are and i i think sky is the limit for you recently i was been skill arbitrage has identified me as the highest paid freelancer what <laughs> so <Sure. laughs> i am so sure. i'm so sure and i'm apart from see money is a great motivation right it's a great motivation i want to ask you you spent 17 years in the domestic market and i'm sure that you have had a certain kind of experience when you were working domestically and is there a difference in when you work with international clients in your experience of working see you're working then you're working now right what is the difference what is your own experience of yourself when you worked before and now when you work they're non judgmental they're non judgmental so say something more about that They i got very non judgmental and then they will take your advice they very serious what you say they respect your uh, experience they respect your expertise and, and but they are very picky what they want so mm-hmm. in case if they found you that is there in you so they will just blindly follow you so they value you if the value is enormous they give you and in case if you are struck also they don't judge you they'll come and they take control of your computer or laptop no they will set right that so yeah. they don't judge you they won't tell you like hey you don't know 17 years ka case they don't yeah. Uh, yeah, they I don't know ask comments I, i like i had experience with this actually all these clients no they don't judge at all that is something amazing i found see if someone gave you this amount of money and they treated you like nothing that and when they give you this kind of money and they value you that's just lethal combination right like it doesn't get better yes you know, because i understand that when people and mm-hmm. when you are working in the domestic market in hr you are at the helm of all that all those people affairs within the company so you're actually bearing a lot right and you have a desire to be valued and i personally seen that people don't sometimes get valued It depends from organization to organization but still So I think what is also great that smile on your face and that shine on your face also comes from one money but also that that you get valued. I think that is something that you really really value about working with these people. Actually right. I told Priyanka what made you to work I said I prefer to sit in front of laptop than desktop. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 
I love to work. I I don't mind working. You keep giving me, I keep working. So yeah, that's, that's... that motivates me. Work motivates me more than money and I did secondary that comes back. That comes when you start work. I believe in that. So I don't. I believe in keep working, keep working, keep working. That's yeah. that is actually true. If you are you if you are doing the work and you are enjoying that, that will ensure you get results. And if you work for the results, it doesn't happen like that. But skill arbitrage, the entire team, I want to thank each and every one. I, I, I don't know. I can tell. First is Rishi. He is my mentor. I go, go to person. Anything in HR or anything. First, Rishi is the first person who will come to me. Any problem, anything he will resolve for me. And Priyanka is there. She's a director, but still she doesn't carry that luggage or the baggage. She's so down to earth. She will come and help you. Uh, and Nidhi she is my posh trainer. She's also, I don't know, entire crew of us. Skill arbitrage is so helpful. But the only thing is you should reach out. You reach out to them. They're ready to help. You have. To, you should only reach out. You should know to reach out. They will teach you all the tips. The work samples, the one uh, like uh, Sanya had taught me. She's... Of course, she's not there now. Amazing tips she had taught me, Sanya. And who else? Even Mr. Siddharth gave me, Dr. Siddharth, I'm sorry. He gave me a lot of tips how to attend the interview. And he helped me to frame my profile properly and help me what and all I should do in LinkedIn. And even Vishal from Upwork, yeah. he gave me a lot of tips. I approached not one, I think majority of the skill arbitrage crew, I have, people I have interacted everybody was ready to anytime they're ready to help amrita is my upwork mentor so till i cracked that even for the proposal stage she used to sit with me <laughs> ma'am main hu main hu aap likho aap likho main hu mil jayega mil jayega she used to tell don't work when i the first time when i got the message from the client what to do that was a dilemma for me because being an international client so amrita what should i do okay ma'am you reply like this so wait for some time. Be quick. Like now the hand holding that you needed. Yes. You needed it. it is new to us. Or yeah. Everything is new to us. And they, uh, skill arbitrage taught me. See, I had the skills. I'm not denying. I had the skills. But you have to put it in a new wine glass. Yeah. So yeah. that was I have been taught. Yeah. So old yeah. wine in a new glass. Yeah. How yeah. to go forward. How to approach the client. The complete different strategies. And giving the free free handouts uh, for the clients i can't remember and then samples work samples and then so many things in fact i also developed much more doing actually i got so much encouragement from skill arbitrage they're oh. always behind me so even today whatever i am taking the projects i feel yeah i think i mean nidhi is with me R R R rishi is with me i can't go to any places yeah. so they are there for me in case if i get stuck they'll help me out yeah yeah. And I want to ask you something. See, you have 17 years of experience when you give yourself this birthday gift, right? And I totally know Vasuli ho gaya hai pura. Matlab, pura ka pura. pura, ka pura. More, you know, like five, six times more aapne Vasuli kar liya. And I really, I, I really value that. But what do you, would, would you think someone who has no experience or someone who has very little experience, what would you say to them? Do you think it'll make the, it'll make the same kind of difference that it made with you? Or will it make a difference with them? If they take up something like this. Nowadays, the people's, the, the way people look at it is different, whether in na internationally or nationally. Skills matters than mm -hmm. the education background or what you, how you carry yourself, how confidently you carry and what skill you bring onto the table. That is what matters. Mm -hmm. So that's what I believe. Even internationally, they bother about that. So what you know, how do you the current uh, situation how do you improvise that's all they matter basically they care about the value that you bring to the table it doesn't matter uh, how many years of experience you have if you bring value to the table then they they're ready to work with you is that what you're in saying in upwork it's three years two years four years five years ka sara openings aata hai. so many but you have to be very quick you should know the strategy you should follow your the yeah. upwork whenever they say you follow just Blame nahi karne ke liye na. You should not blame them. They are giving you all the tips. Follow it vigorously. 
then the things will happen you just listen and then leave it you don't do it things will not move not move yeah, yeah. miracles exactly. won't happen yeah you have to that. ready to put hard work you have to i got that yeah we have to put hard work i so, was Okay. I, I I researched so much about Upwork and I used to share it with Rishi and I used to share it with Amrita. What clockwise, what countries work, how they flash as this as jobs. All those things I was doing. Yeah. All that research I was doing actually. I, I totally get that. Skill arbitrage provided what it provided, but you were ready fully to receive it. That's the reason you got benefited the way you got benefited. I'm fully enrolled in that. Someone, everyone has the same resources, but people, people have different success stories. They have different trajectories because it differs the kind of work they put in. And if someone puts in the work like you did, sky is the limit for them. So I got that. I have one more question from someone who's here today. And they asked that they have an HR consultancy firm. How do you think that this course can help them? Even consultancies uh, pro- through Upwork, they as an agency, they can approach. Got it. Okay. Yeah, through Upwork, they, they have... And do, do you think, you know, support from skill arbitrage comes handy to expand their consulting business? I am a living example. Living example. <laughs> you should go to the right people, right time. All right. Prishma, I hope that answers your question. Right? Yeah. Okay. And what would you say... So I just want to ask you, what have earnings been like? I know because I yeah, I, yeah, I, I have, heard about you. So far between 10 and 12 lakhs I have earned so far. So yeah. another 5 lakhs projects is in the pipeline. And in how long? In the pipeline. If it comes, no, next month I will be going. <laughs> okay, got it. <laughs> wonderful, 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 wonderful. Anything else of you there that you want to highlight about me now? I want to tell actually one more thing. Like even even today, I took another uh, one more session with for trading from uh, because I have a session. So Nidhi was ready to give me. <laughs> she was ready to give me. What else you wanted? What else you can expect from skill arbitrage apart from this? She spent yeah. nearly 15, 20 minutes. She helped me. She gave me a brief about everything. We know you are ready to go. Wow. Nothing more than, nothing more you can expect. Can we say that this is not available anywhere else, this kind of thing? I haven't experienced <laughs> Anywhere, right? No. Because a lot of people who are listening today, they are listening from that filter. Ye bas ek course hai. Bahut hai market mein. <laughs> MBA bhi kiya hai, wala. Phir bhi nahi ho raha, to ye to degree bhi nahi hai. Nah, skill arbitrage, I think you people, you should, you have to be, if you are very serious, you take it up. And if you are very serious, implement it whatever they say are the truth true hacks only they are teaching you you implement it you will see wonders miracles hoga Chap, haap, seriously kaam karege, definitely hoga. great, great. what know. do you say to people on the fence jo soch rahe ki karna chahiye ki nahi <laughs> Aap, karna chahiye, but it's like me probably i was working around 8 to 10 hours very seriously they have the same commitment every day, some two hours commitment, three hours commitment. Actually, skill arbitrage people, mentors, too, they say this actually. Have that commitment. So even mentors are there, they will they will track your progress. Even with them, they can talk. They have so many facilities. So if you touch base everything, I think sky is the limit. Only thing is you, you should know how to use, utilize, climb up the ladder. Yeah. So that's what my experience so far. Great, great. Super, super. Thank you so much, Veena, for joining us at this hour and sharing your experience. And you're truly such an inspiring person. We're very proud of your progress. Thank and you. we're very happy that we could make a contribution. And she's not the only one. There are hundreds of people who are doing work and getting results. Yeah. Yeah. Super, super. Thank, Thank you. you so much. Thank you so much. Thank awesome. you for having me. Thank you. Bye. Uh, Bye. Mansi, it was Veena's special request that she wanted to speak to a business consultant. So I have... Sure, we'll set up a call then in that case, Veena. <laughs> we'll have yeah, Mansi, you. please. I will. I would love to do that. I will come through Mili or uh, Asta. Great. No, you can just, I'll ask her to send you my contact details and we'll set up a call. Thank you so much. Thank you. Perfect. Thank you. And guys, your feedback on the experience, did this help you?